Good evening, West Des Moines police are investigating racial slurs targeting black Iowa lawmakers. As KCCI's Kayla James explains, it happened over a Zoom meeting to discuss the legislative session. Kayla. Yeah, Laura and police don't know who did this, but they are trying to find out. We don't have video of the attack, but lawmakers explain exactly what happened. I felt like I was playing whack-a-mole once one threat came up. I tried to make sure I shut it down, then another threat would come up. And Al Womble says the racist attacks continued that way, done by multiple people. They wrote the N-word on there, what looked like a swastika, putting up images of a monkey. Noted speakers that night include representatives Ross Smith and Ross Wilburn. Womble recalls the racial slurs being said and shown when Representative Phyllis Thede was speaking. It was only 10 minutes into my speech, and then all of a sudden, this picture came up. Womble eventually got everything under control, kicking offenders out, but not before he says people screamed out more slurs. What bothers him about this is it's something he feels is becoming too common. He knows the time back in 2021. I hate kill when a town hall held by Representative Akeo Abdul Samad and Representative Marty Anderson was interrupted. And further, back in 2020, when during a meeting involving the Des Moines Civil Rights Commission, racially charged images and words appeared on the screen. Al Womble says he believes the best way to put a stop to these racial incidents is for everyone to speak up and condemn them. Because when individuals don't speak out against this, People are going to find aid and comfort in the fact that people did not respond. As for what to do when something like this happens, no matter if it's a racial threat or threats at other meetings, Womble says it's best to be like Representative Thede and push forward. It's important that we all stand up against anything, anything, because if we don't, what's going to happen is that people think they get away with it. And the Iowa Democratic Party chairman Ross Wilburn was on the Zoom, Zoom as well during the attacks. He released a statement today saying, quote, unfortunately, these despicable experiences of harassment are far too common for black Iowans. That's why it's crucial all Iowans speak up and hold those accountable for bigoted actions and statements. The Iowa Republican Party said it, quote, condemns any actions taken by individuals to harass and intimidate people based on the color of their skin. Criminals should be prosecuted to the fullest extent of the law. Laura.